Anne Boleyn, why did the cow cross the road? Why did the cow cross the road, Crystal? It was utterly lost. <laughs> so after sitting in the um, eye doctors for two and a half hours, I was finally like, all right, I'm gonna go sit in the car. So me and my girlfriend are currently sitting in the car. Well, actually her mom offered for us to sit in the car and I'm like, hell yeah, please. Because all three of them had appointments Crystal got new glasses, so we sat there trying to find her a pair that was totally cute and funny. I wish I could have recorded it. And then her dad got a pair, and it was just a big old process. And it's literally been two and a half hours. I'm not exaggerating. And uh, her parents are still in the um, eye doctor place. So, yeah. That's that. And then... We're going to go out to eat. I think we're going to Olive Garden. Um, so, on the front of, like, me counting calories perfectly and cooking for myself, I've been doing not so great the last, yesterday and today, but um, I'm still, you know, still watching what I eat and not, like, going insane. So, that's important, but I just kind of wanted to, you know check in and say what's going on so i'm gonna sit out in the car and i swear to god this better not take much longer because i'm like going stir crazy <laughs> I feel like I need to make this official. We've officially been here for three hours now. Oh my god, they're coming! I don't know if you saw them, but perfect timing. <laughs> if this store isn't crowded, then I don't know what is. This aisle from here all the way down is all sorts of bars. We stand here for about five minutes. <laughs> no, no, no ice cream. No ice cream. Bad, bad, bad. <laughs> yeah, you can hand me those. You can hand me them. It's not focusing good. It's weird. The meatball kind of tasted like it would be in a TV dinner. I don't know. I mean, it was good. I'm sure you'd like it. We're ordering from Padrino, Padrino's V. And yeah, so that's what we're eating today. Oh, there we go. Now we can see it better. Let's show them what I'm getting. Where is it? Uh -huh. Where is it? <laughs> oh. Baked dinners, lasagna with meat and cheese. And it comes with garlic bread and salad. Cause that's healthy. What are you getting? Mm. She doesn't know yet. Get out of here. Okay, bye. <laughs> so I made this for my girlfriend and I to eat. It's potatoes pesto and a little bit of bacon bits. I honestly can put pesto on anything.
besides desserts. But who knows? It might be good too. But I love pesto. It's like one of my favorite things. So just kind of wanted to show you what I made. So this is my plate. I already ate one potato and it is delicious. My girlfriend cut hers all up. And I wanted to interview her. No, not really. I just wanted to ask her, how does it taste? Good. <laughs> Tastes good. Would you ever want to eat this again? Yeah. She's being shy. Behind camera, she's jumping up and down how delicious it is. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> no, but it's really good. It's just little baby potatoes, pesto, you know, regular pesto, and then some of those. Honestly, try this. It's a good breakfast. Even though we wake up really late, I'll have to explain that in a whole other thing because I'm making this vlog already long and all I'm doing is talking about food. But yeah, it's really good and yeah, I recommend it. So right now, me and my girlfriend are cleaning our bathroom and she's bringing this down to the downstairs bathroom, cherry blossom soap. There's a reason for this, trust me. <laughs> she's bringing this one, coconut and warm ginger, down to the kitchen, because we do wash our hands in the kitchen, obviously. And you know, she tells me, she goes, Coconut Kitchen. That'd be a cute restaurant name. <laughs> so this is dinner. I made broccoli in the oven. That stuff is this cheese, pepper, and I, I like it to be very peppery because it does give a good flavor. And obviously some, a little bit of pesto I put in there. Just like the tiniest little bit and it helped a lot. This is just brown rice. I put salsa in it and some hot sauce that we use called Cholulu. And just the tiniest bit of this cheese too. And that is a tamale. It's a processed food tamale, yes, it was frozen. Only took three minutes to warm up, but who cares? I'm doing better. I made myself broccoli, even though I put lots of pepper and a little bit of pesto, but it helps with the flavor. So I just kind of wanted to show this and I'm not counting calories like I said, but if I was, all this is probably about 400 calories and that's not bad at all for a dinner so yeah what what did I just do to you Damn. <laughs> I think she has decided this is no longer a toy and instead it's a bed I'm not too sure if he's so happy about that though. <laughs> he's like, no, this is mine. What did you just say about this? <laughs> what did you just say about it? Don't put that laughter on me though. I said I want it for my next birthday. What did you just say about it? Don't put that laughter on me though. I said I want it. <laughs> <laughs>